She loves you. She surrenders her body to you. You do whatever you want with her. What women do when they love a man. Men keep asking themselves, does this woman love me? Or does she love my money? Does she love me? Does she like me? Can she commit herself totally to me? These are real questions in the minds of men. You need to understand that a woman's love evolves through four stages. A woman's love for a man grows through four stages. Stage number one is when the woman likes you. At this stage, she's attracted to you. She admires you. Stage number two is when a woman trusts you. She feels safe and secure with you and in your presence. Stage number three is the stage of love. At this stage, the woman feels you're reliable. You are dependable. She can rely on you. And the fourth stage is when a woman commits to you. She believes in you. She's ready to lay down her life for you. Let's go through these four stages because women do different stuff at different stages of the relationship. So at the first stage, stage number one of the relationship is when the woman likes you. She gets attracted to you. She admires to you. I want to mention four things that a woman does when she likes you, when she admires you, when she's attracted to you. Number one, she listens to you. She listens to all your stories. She finds you fascinating. She even listens to your silly jokes. Number two, she teases you. She tries to box you, to seduce you. She wants you to become hers. She feels shy. She acts shy in your presence like a 16-year-old girl. She even buys you gifts for no apparent reason. What that means, it's not your birthday, there is nothing happening, but she just brings you a watch or a belt or a pair of shoes or some sweets, some candies. Number three, she introduces you to her friends. She's excited about you. She wants everyone to know you. She wants everyone around her, her circles, to get to meet this guy, her boyfriend. She actually introduces you as my boyfriend. <laughs> and number four, she spends time with you. She finds you interesting. She talks to, to you differently than, to, than anyone else. Stage number two is the stage of trust. It's when the woman feels safe with you. She feels secure with you. Now, four things when a woman trusts you. Number one, she now talks to you. At the first stage of liking, she listens to you. At this stage, she begins the conversation. She shares with you her past. She talks to you about her experiences and her history. She lets you know about her life, her past life. Number two. She touches you. <laughs> she initiates the touches. She begins to reveal her feelings and her emotions for you. At this stage, she trusts you now to leave her bag and rush to the restroom. In fact, she can even leave her bag open. She leaves her phone with you. She can trust you. She feels comfortable in your presence. Number three, she introduces you to her family. Remember the first stage of the relationship. She only introduces you to her friends, but now she introduces you to her family. She begins with her siblings, if she's not an only child, her brother or her sister, and then she introduces you to her parents. And number four, she consults you. She seeks your advice. Before she buys a car, she wants to ask you for advice. She even gives you her car to take her to the garage for oil change or servicing. She wants to consult you before she changes jobs. Even if she's in a rental house and she wants to move to another place, she wants to consult you because she wants to be nearer you. She values your opinion. Stage number three is when the woman now loves you. Why? She now thinks you're reliable. You are dependable. She thinks the relationship has grown to another stage. Four things at this stage of the relationship. Number one, she begins to be interested with your interest. She actually shows keen interest in your interest. If she never used to watch soccer and she realized that boyfriend is a Liverpool fan, she begins to master some of the names of the players of Liverpool. 
like Mane and Salah and Alexander and Firmino and Origi. You know, she begins to be interested with your area of interest. Even if it's faking, she didn't like soccer before, but suddenly she begins to watch, say, Survivor with you because she realizes you're into movies. She begins to follow your interest. Number two, she cares for you. She wants to be sure you're grooming, you are well. She takes care of how you comb your hair. She wants to be sure you're dressing well. She will help you with your homework. If you're a researcher, she will help you with data entry. If she has the skill for data analysis, she will do that with you. If you're going to make a presentation somewhere, she will help you to make the slides. She begins to take care of you. In fact, some women will even come and fix the dinner for you or even do some laundry for you. Number three, she yields to you. She allows you into her personal space. Initially, she was touching you, but now she allows you to touch her. She even invites you to her house. She no longer sees that as an intrusion to her privacy. Number four, this is tricky. This is huge. She gives you her body. Wow. You can touch her. You can kiss her. This is the stage at which men have to make sober decisions. This is where real men have to make a sober decision that I will preserve the woman for my wedding night. Because at this juncture, at this stage of the relationship, the woman holds nothing from the man. If you trigger her slightly, she will sleep with you. At this stage of the relationship, she's ready to remove all her clothes for you. She doesn't hold anything back. Now, the man has to be on the steering wheel of the relationship or you will go all the way with no reverse gear. Unfortunately, very few men start up to the occasion, so they literally begin engaging in sex at this stage of the relationship because the man was not strong enough to realize now he has to lead the girl into chastity, into more commitments, into discussing their life together. At this stage, the woman is like on heat and she will hit on the man, H-I-T. The first one is H-E-A-T. She's like an animal on heat. She's like an animal on the loose. And she will hit on you, H-I-T. Stage number four. This is the stage whereby the woman commits to the man. She believes in you. She sees your lives inextricably bound together, inseparable. She sees the two of you as one item four things at this stage of the relationship number one she attends to your needs she attends to the needs of the man any single need now remember women commit differently some will commit through a wedding ceremony some will just walk into your house what we call come we stay and they will never return you start seeing them bring some clothes bring their stuff they get in your house and you wonder when or not did i get married oh uh oh you crossed the line of love to commitment. Remember, one can't commit before they love you, they can't love you before they trust you, they can't trust you before they like you. So by the time they commit, they already like you, they trust you, and they love you. Now they are committing their lives to you. Number two, she corrects you. When you're wrong, she will correct you. Before, she overlooked your faults. Right now, she cannot allow you to mess up with her. She can't even allow you to threaten her. She can't allow you to mess up with her life. So when you make a mistake, she will correct you. She corrects the flaws in you. Why? She begins to see your life together. So she will not overlook faults as she did in the past. It is at this stage, a lot of men say the woman changed. She didn't change. You need to grow up, gentlemen. You need to learn to accept corrections. You need to accept this is a life partner right now. And she beautifies me. She makes me better. So she is able to spot some flaws and some mistakes in you. And to correct you because she wants you to improve in your career life. In your professional life. In your spiritual life. In your parenting life. In your physical. How you groom. Everything about you in your emotional life. She will correct you if you have loose tempers. She wants you to manage your emotions. 
at this juncture, she will not allow you to be all over teasing with other women. She wants you to settle down. So you will be hearing a lot of corrections from time to time. Number three, she submits to you. She completely surrenders to your leadership. She submits to your authority. She allows you to lead her life, to lead her. She follows you at your vision, at your dreams. You would rather have a sound mind. You would rather be sane. You would rather know where you are taking her. Because now she likes you. She trusts your sanity. She loves you. And she has committed her destiny into your hands. And number four, she gives you her money. <laughs> when you find a woman working and bringing all her earnings to you, she can take a loan for you. You will start buying mortgage together. I mean, a house on mortgage together. I mean, you want to buy a car. You have these crazy business ideas. She gives you the money. She hopes for the best. Even if the money disappears with the weeds, she risks her all to you. Remember, money reveals one's values and priorities and where her heart is. When you find someone surrendering all her money to you, all her earnings, all her incomes, she has surrendered her heart and her life and her destiny into your hands. She doesn't care. If you want a joint bank account, she signs it quickly until you betray her trust. Until you start misbehaving and sharing family income with another woman. That's when, and you know when? When you lose her trust, it's almost impossible to regain it. Now, I want to ask you, dude, come on. At what stage is your relationship? Look at all these four stages. Look at the matrix on the screen right now. Look at the matrix on the screen. What is the stage of your relationship? Remember stage one is where she's attracted to you. She listens, she teases, she introduces you to her friends. She spends time with you. Stage two, she trusts you. Now she talks to you about her history, her past experiences. She initiates the touches. She introduces you to her family. She consults you. She seeks your advice. Stage number three, she loves you. She finds you reliable, dependable. She expresses interest in your interests. She cares for you. She yields to you. She surrenders her body to you. You do whatever you want with her. I mean, she's naked and not ashamed in your presence. She hopes you can boost her confidence, her self-image. Stage number four, she commits to you totally. She believes in you. She attends to your needs. She corrects you. She wants you to be a better man. She submits her life to you. She gives you all her money. She surrenders all her resources to you. And if you are a, a stay-at-home mom and you're not working, at this juncture, the woman trusts you so much that she believes you provide to the family, you will take care of her and her needs and your children together. At this stage, she completely believes in you. Come on, come on, tell me now. Talk to me. At what stage of the relationship are you? Or you're not in any stage, you're in a situationship. Remember, at any given stage, out of these four stages, a relationship can break. But stage three and four, where the woman loves you and submits to you, it becomes shattering. She becomes extremely heartbroken because she loves you. And then stage four, she has committed to you. That is the stage at which if the relationship breaks, the woman can be depressed. Come on, let me know your thoughts. Give me your comments in this video. And if this video blessed you, Please share it with your friends, like it, and share it with your friends, colleagues, and family. By the way, I have a complimentary video that goes along with this, dubbed Eight Things Men Do When They Are In Love. Eight Things Men Do When They're In Love. You will love to watch this video. Come on, all you need to do is to subscribe to my YouTube channel to access hundreds and hundreds of inspirational videos free of church. Just subscribe to my YouTube channel and ring the bell to get notified whenever I upload new videos. Thank you very much. I wish you the very best in your relationship. Shalom! <laughs>